My name is Dr. Habib. Uh, I'm a pediatric endocrinologist. I've been in practice for 40 years. Uh, today we're going to talk about the relation or the connection between chromium and diabetes. It's estimated in this country that 90% of people are chromium deficient. Uh, the high consumption of carbs, uh, especially sugar drinks in the diet, including sodas, uh, juices, uh, honey, candy, fructose, etc., will increase usually uh, urinary chromium loss by 300% for 12 hours. So in simple English, every time you drink a 8 ounces glass of uh, orange juice, apple juice, uh, or a soda, uh, you lost all the chromium uh, that you have in your body uh, for in your urine uh, for at least 12 hours. Uh, what does chromium do or what's the relation of chromium to blood sugar or to diabetes? Uh, chromium as uh, some of you know or all of you know uh, is uh, called in the old days GTF glucose tolerance factor. What's the glucose tolerance factor or the GTF? It is a association uh, of or combination of chromium-3, D-nicotinic acid, and glutathione. So the combination of these three things make what is called the glucose tolerance factor. And what does glucose tolerance factor do? It works or mimic insulin. In simple English, it transports glucose from the outside of the cell to inside of the cell. Uh, chromium deficiency uh, is a major cause of the development of diabetes mellitus type 2 in this country and in the world. Fasting plasma chromium level are usually very low in the pregnant woman and it is lower for the non-pregnant woman. It is believed that the impairment of glucose tolerance or the impaired glucose tolerance test during pregnancy, which lead to what is called gestational diabetes, is caused by chromium deficiency. A lot of researchers also feel that the craving phenomenon, which is seen uh, during pregnancy by some women, uh, is related to chromium deficiency. Uh, chromium deficiency is aggravated by vanadium deficiency, which means if you are deficient in vanadium, this will accelerate or aggravate chromium deficiency. It is very important when you choose a chromium supplement to be careful what supplement or what chromium supplement you choose. I usually do not recommend chromium picaronate because it's usually reported to cause some chromosomal damage, which means it could be carcinogenic, and therefore I recommend chromium polynicotinate or chromium chelate. Uh, if you need more information concerning chromium and the other mineral connected with blood glucose metabolism, please visit our website at triolife.com.